watching a previous live stream from Twitch. I interact with the chat during this video, so while it may seem like I'm crazy, I'm actually not. Don't worry, I'm not insane. Join me occasionally on Twitch and I'll post videos when I go live. Samoa. Um, any other cores over here I can get rid of on these guys? I don't think there's any other little tiny thing in here. That's Hawaiian. Okay. Can I actually release the Raj? Is that a thing I can do? Is that, hang on, was this one Seagull? No, this wasn't Seagull. This was. Never mind. Um. Oh shoot, what did I just release? Oh, did I just release like some Indian thing? Freak, what did I just release? Oh, yeah, and then I can do this. There, I just inherited. I forgot I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> and then I can release them again. <laughs> That's just a little bit gamey, though. Um, M-A-H-A-R. Was that the other one I released? Nope, not that one. I released something and I don't know what it is. B A L U C H. Oops. Oh, that's this guy. Um, shoot. What did I do? This looks right. What is this? M A U R. Oh, this is what. Yep, this is the one right here. Okay. That's something at least. Camarus. Camarus. So now I'm releasing all these little tiny islands. S E Y C H. And dropping my infamy like crazy. I was at 24, I'm down to 6. British Indian Ocean Territory. Right, let's see if I can actually release that. Let's 
go ahead and release Sri Lanka while we're here. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, not an option. But I did release this guy. Because he's not he's not connected to my mess here. Uh, that's Malaysia. And the Raj, which I don't think we have an option for the Raj. S H I M S I M A L. S I M A L A. Oh, right here. I see. Rwanda, Panama. Chengo Islands? De Grisho. D E okay. D I Oh, that would be them. All right. So after all that, I'm down to two point eight infinity after releasing a whole bunch of islands. I don't care. I really, really don't care. All right, now when does I international isolationism fall off? 42? Bullcrap. Bullcrap, that ends in 42. There's no way that's 42. Oh, Australia is a great power. That's awesome. France is working its way back up. So is Italy. Let's not even worry about that right now. Um, Yeah, it looks like the Caribbean Federation has fallen to 28th now, so I'm not going to have to worry about this. Uh, strategist, which version of H, uh, HPM? Um, I believe it's one. H, HPM is dot four two, I believe. Um, is the one you would be looking for. How are we doing here? Militant socialists are still kind of a thing. Mm. Let's go ahead and give them a 12-hour workday. That's not too terrible for them. All right, they discovered the bones. Good for the good for the British. Hold on, let's see what this is. 
Um, Armenia acquires all states with core provinces. No. Let's uh, go ahead and yes. <laughs> hey, Armenia, welcome to the world. Just ripped apart the Turkish Socialist Republic for no reason there. I did that for absolutely no reason. <laughs> ah, an excellent idea, I say. That's not what I wanted. Come on, you gotta fall off. I'm gonna wait until next year and see if it falls off. If it doesn't, I'm gonna be super annoyed. Well, there goes that. So Armenia, voting rights rescinded. Ah, oh, look at that. They became a presidential dictatorship. Well done. I love poor Romania there. Poor, poor Romania. Oh, okay, the Dust Bowl. After fairly favorable climate conditions in the 20, with good rainfall and relatively moderate, moderate winters, with a permanent increase in settlement and cultivation of the Great Plains, prairies, regions of the United States of America enter an unusual dry era in the summer of 1933. During the drought of, of the 1930s, un, unanchored soil turned to dust, which preventing prevailing winds blew into huge clouds, sometimes black in the sky. These choking billi billows of dust named black blizzards, or black rollers, Traveled cross country, reaching as far as the East Coast, striking such cities as New York and Washington, D.C. On the plains, there's often reduced visibility to one meter or three feet. Already hundreds of people packing up and move. Many wait their gaze direction at D.C. to see what the government was responsible to be. And dang right, let's get on this. I have $19 million, there's no reason not to. Yes, Armenia, we will be friends. Oh, I'm going to I'm going to let all trade reunions be allowed and see if that helps anything. Oh, that's a lot of Patriots. This is being somewhat well managed. Oh, okay, that helped a lot. Alright, how are we doing here? Right. Yep, Italy's creeping its way back up. Fifteen hundred days, well it's slowly, slowly going down. I'm hoping after this year international isolationism will fall off. Those freaking wars are still going on. Nope. Yeah, I think it's stuck in there. We're not going to be good. This is not going to be good. Yeah, that international isolationism is just killing us. I could dismantle the Empire of Mexico again. 
Yeah, it's going to take 10 years to justify. Oh my god, okay. You know what? I'm just going to leave this guy. He can have a great time on his own. Can't make a puppet out of you, though, Brazil. God. This is annoying. Very, very annoying. I do have a dismantled one on you, but I can't justify it. Oh. God, this is it's becoming super annoying. I want to justify. I'd love... Poor France. Like, folks... Freaking heck, Ocean exists. All must see our splendor. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, that Bulgarian one actually ended. My god. Oh, they took it. Yeah, it was this they wanted and they took it. Now Romania is being beat up by Hungary. Oh, the Ukraine took the Crimea. That's awesome. Friendly. Friendly. Okay, good. Let's see if we can get Armenia, or not Armenia, uh, Arabia created here, because that would be cool. Fort George. Timber for fish. Timber, timber, timber. There is the timber. Oh, we're pretty well being outstripped there. What about for fish, though? Eh, a little less, but it's worth more. Yeah, that's fine. Do the fisheries. Sure, get get my literacy on. Don't know who you are, don't care. Jacobian rebels. Freaking communist France. Oh, cool, they finally took that. I'm amazed they haven't made any other moves here. Who are you at war with? Oh, you're at war with him. Okay, it looks like China's fi finally getting around to put itself back together. Oh, I could declare another state of emergency. Let's try not to this time. Just saying. All right, let's uncheck this. Oh, yeah, let's go ahead and sign the Geneva Convention. I completely forgot to do that. Alright, hang on, what do you want? Safe working conditions, I can give you that. 
There, be happy. Should take care of a lot of problems. Germany wants to ally me. Do I want to risk allying Germany? Oh, look. Poland took that. This is a... Oh, wow. This is a full-blown World War II Germany right here. Hmm. No, I do not. Wait a minute, who's yellow? Oh, that's Indonesia. Oh, uh, what is this? Oh, coffee, not a chance. Coffee for fruit? No. So much lag. Japan wants to ally me. Oh, I don't think that's a good idea. Absolutely not, Japan. Don't know, even know who you are. Wait, what is this? Oh! <laughs> Full citizenship for everyone. Yugoslavia is declared. Oh my god, everyone's taking a piece out of Romania. Yeah. Hate the fact that goes until forty frickin' two. Well, I have literally no infinity, but I can't do anything with it because it's gonna take frickin' four years, four or five years in order to uh get anywhere. Well, alright, so yeah, this is probably gonna be end of the game here. Yep, form Arabia. All right, so if I can go fast enough here, I can get this. This has to just get to 100 here before the end of the year. Yeah, uh, friggin' Bourbon Democrats again. All right, well, I have six months to get to 100. I'm just going to add them to my sphere. Just for funsies. At that point, no reason not to. Oh, I might not make it. Ooh, this is going to come down to the wire. I'll go ahead and ally you real grand.
All right, there we go. Let's go form Arabia. <laughs> Strong, stable ally right here. Welcome to American Arabia. They are a full-blown republic. That is awesome. <laughs> oh. Like, seriously. Go ahead and put points into that. Uh, we got we got like a month. All right, really quickly before we end this, then I'm going to show you the sphere of influence map. Oh, so Japan, <laughs> Mexico is in Japan's sphere of influence. Oh, we're not going to be able. To, okay, they're tough to see. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. Okay, so they're this like slightly off gray. Oh, Italy became a gray power. That is Italy, right? As their own gray power? Yes, they are. They knocked Russia out. <laughs> oh my god, that's fantastic. Alright, so Russia got knocked out. I got the I got the Near East with Uzbekistan that just kicked itself out of there. Um we got most of India there, Papua New Guinea, all these little islands around here. Japan's still great power. <laughs> god, that's awesome. And I'll attach, I'll, I'll take screenshots of the full map and attach them to the end, showing the whole breakdown. I mean, I got most of Africa. Like, I don't even know here. This is amazing. This was an amazing playthrough. I hope everyone has enjoyed this. Because I know I did. A uh, hundred monumentalist years have passed, and we have entered the modern era. We radically, the world is a radically <laughs> different place. How did your country do? Let's find out. All right, so my final score was 17,333, with the next highest being 3,051 as Germany. I was a four, full 14,000 points more. Japan, all that good stuff. Um, I mean, the most interesting ones out of here was probably the fact that Indonesia and the Ardenian, uh, and Dinian, okay, screw this, this federation exists and are great powers. Um, you almost never see this guy make it past and exist for very long. He, the fact that I created him all this, um, France is communist, Russia is, <laughs> Russia is fascist, the Empire of Mexico was a great power until I kicked their alien crap out of them. Um, Ukraine's independent. God, Indonesia is another one you normally don't see because that requires the removal of, from Netherlands, which doesn't always happen. But the greater, greater United States has become something amazing. Let's take a quick look at the red ledger. Military score-wise, I was 2560, more than the next two combined in between Indonesia and Germany. Industrial score, 7,535. Probably greater than the top, like, 10 at that point. Prestige-wise. Oh, that's funny. Norway was the second highest on prestige at 415. Look, just look at those numbers. Uh, total pop-wise, I was the highest. Was, oh my god, I had 665 million people. Look at this, though. Russia only had 82 million people in there. And this guy and Anholm was the next highest. Oh, that's China. These two are China. That's right. These two are fighting over China. But my God, look at that population. That's all. A lot of that's India. I guarantee it. Um, doesn't matter here. Doesn't matter here. No, no. Uh, out of sheer curiosity, where did all the capitalists end up? Japan. Japan had almost double my capitalists. I had the most intellectuals by far. Most clerks by far. Most craftsmen by far. Yeah. Look at my look at my mili my soldiers. Seven point three six million and more oh my god. Oh, yeah, bureaucrats. This is kinda interesting though. I'm surprised I was so low on capitalists. I would expect Oh, actually, that's a good point. What is... At a population of one? What? Oh, these are the provinces. Never mind. I was like, what the heck? Still, that province only has one person in it? Like, really? Anything else in here? No, we don't really care. 
Don't care about this either. Okay, we're good. Alrighty, everyone. I hope you guys have enjoyed this stream. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed this playthrough, too. This was a really fun one. I will take screenshots of the map there and put them at the very end. So you can give you, I'll give you like a 10, 15 second um, rundown on YouTube um, showing you the full map and the full sphere of influence and everything. Um, so I hope it all went well for you guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you, everyone who subscribed. Stein, that's you for sure, uh, the gifter of subs. Uh, thank everyone who gave bits. Um, not sure on all those. Uh, I hate to say it. I know there was anonymous ones. I know the strategists, and I know there's a few other ones. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed this. This was a really fun playthrough, and I will probably be back to Anno 1800 here, maybe. Um, like this was three weeks in between the other two, so we'll see what happens. So, th thank you guys, um, and I will see you guys next time I play. Later.